Good Sunday morning, everybody. Welcome back. Thank you for joining us. I'm Lexi Suter alongside Jeff Penner, who is monitoring a lot of stuff today. A uh, lot of thunderstorms up in northern Missouri. Some of these areas this week had 8 to 10 inches of rain, wow. and they're getting pounded again. Mm -hmm. Crop damage is likely. It's yeah. just ridiculous up there. And let's take a look. Right Death of a person considered to be suspicious this morning. Now police are investigating. That investigation happening in the 7,000 block of Longview. That's where we find 41 Action News reporter Lisa Benson, who joins us live now. And Lisa, what do you have? We talked to Nick. All right, new this morning, crews are searching for victims after an overnight building collapse in India. The building fell, killing at least four people and injuring nearly a dozen. But that number could rise as people are still trapped this morning. We don't know what caused that building to collapse there. A teacher from Blue Springs comes home from a beach vacation with disfiguring burns on her hand. She got them from a common fruit popular in many cocktails. 41 Action News reporter Josh Helmuth has a warning that it could happen to you. Dr. Anderson says lemons, celery leaves, fig and parsley are other common foods that can cause severe burns. He says anyone is susceptible and it's important to always wash up and use your sunscreen. John McCain has yet to respond to comments made by presidential candidate Donald Trump about McCain's military service. Get a listen to this. Way to repeal That's Trump speaking at a family leadership summit. This morning, there are calls from several other politicians for Trump to apologize. McCain spent five years as a prisoner of war in Vietnam. This morning, the criticism continues, though, with Trump tweeting just hours ago that McCain has done nothing to help veterans. We've got an update on the troubles surrounding FIFA this morning. The group's former vice president pleaded not guilty to federal racketeering and bribery charges in connection.